Hi folks, this is Andrew Briggs from internetmarketingtooltips.com with another tooltip for you. Today I would like to look at a website called Wordle. Wordle, oh, I spelled it wrong, but at least it comes up in the first search result. Now, Wordle is a website that allows you to generate word clouds. It's just a simple tool online and it allows you to generate nice looking graphics including lots of words and uh, words of different sizes, shapes, colours, uh, different backgrounds. Um, it just allows you to generate a nice uh, image that you may want to put on your website um, or put on a, a blog that um, is related to a certain group of words, say health for instance, you may put in lots of health words and uh, generate a nice wordle uh, word cloud. So again it's very simple, free, um, something that I've used in the past and, and I'll do one for my website for this uh, blog post as well. And all you need to do is uh, enter uh, a list of words. So I've got a few uh, examples for you. So for instance, here's a, a list of words relating to internet marketing, um, things like Facebook ads, article mar marketing, solo ads, WordPress, blah blah blah. So just a few words that I uh, jotted down that uh, are related to internet marketing and we'll see what uh, Wordle does with them. So you just paste them straight into the input box and you just hit go. Just takes a few seconds and as you see it just generates an image with uh, all these words that you've just pasted in and it's just different sizes etc so it's all quite random so you can hit the randomize button and it will just take it will just randomize the settings and it will just create another image for you and you can just keep going until you find one that you like or you can actually go up and edit uh, a number of the settings so for instance if you want to change the layout and say, well, I want instead of the words being mostly horizontal, I want them to be uh, half and half. Okay, so it will then begin to uh, generate images that are, are more to your liking or uh, any which way. It's very mixed. Uh, you can also change the color schemes. So. There you go, you apply the colour schemes to the words that are already there. And again, you can just change the the way that it generates them. So it's sticking to your preference once you've chosen a, a preference from these from the, the menus. So a number of uh, palettes there for you. Uh, you can also uh, edit palettes, etc. So it's pretty good, it, uh, it's very quick um, and it's it's really simple and sometimes you just want to rattle through a number of randomised images to see uh, which ones suit you and grab the one that you want. You can save it to a public gallery or you can print it. Um, what I would suggest is that you would print it to a PDF using Qt PDF or some other tool um, to allow you to print to a PDF and that means that you can then resize it to whatever size you want on your, your web page. The other option that you can uh, try out is the advanced option where you can load or weight the words so that in the word, all, in word cloud the words are emphasized so for instance uh, another selection here the, the, um, the format is the the words as as they were before but this time you're adding a weight to each word and um, so as you see affiliate marketing has a weight of 200 Facebook Twitter Google also uh, they all have weightings of 100 there's some smaller weightings YouTube so uh, we should expect to see Affiliate marketing popping up as the largest with a number of the other websites such as Facebook, Twitter, Google, YouTube, etc. popping up uh, a little bit smaller than affiliate marketing but uh, larger than a number of the other options. So let's uh, just 
paste that in and have a wee look at the, the response from Wordle. So there you go. Affiliate marketing is large. Twitter, Facebook, YouTube, Google Plus are smaller but are certainly still bigger than a lot of the other uh, smaller weighted words. And this allows you to make words bigger. Um, and especially if it's appropriate to your website. So that's quite a good one there. So, um, so I hope you find that useful. It's an interesting little tool. Uh, you may find that you can put it to some use, put to, uh, creating word clouds for your own website, um, emphasizing certain uh, themes uh, or niches or, or words uh, to your own liking. So give it a crack. Okay, speak soon. Bye.